Hi, I'm Dara from websites to simple.com. In this video, you are going to learn how to set up a free business email address in just five minutes. A business email will make you look more professional online and you can get up to five business email addresses for free. By the end of this video, you'll be receiving and sending emails from your business email account in just three easy steps. So let's get started. Step one is to set up your domain name. A domain name is your website's address like WebsitesOSimple.com. If you don't have a domain, you'll need to get one in order to set up your business email. Now, normally a domain costs around $15 per year and a business email is another $5 per month per email account. Now, luckily I've organized a pretty cool discount to save you some money. When you click the link in the description, you get a free domain and up to five free business email addresses when you purchase a $2.95 per month website hosting plan with Bluehost. And you don't need to set up a website to get your business email. If you use our referral link to make a purchase, we will receive a commission at no cost to you, so that helps us out too. Now, if you already have a domain with Bluehost, you can skip to step two now. If you need a domain, click Get Started and select the basic hosting plan. Next, we'll set up your domain. To create a new domain, just enter your website name and click Next. Once you see that your domain is available, fill out your account information, untick any extras that you don't want, enter your payment information, agree to the terms and hit Submit. Once you see that your purchase was a success, go ahead and create your account. And at the end of the account setup process, you'll land inside your Bluehost dashboard where you can set up your business email. Step two is to create your free business email address. On the left menu, if you click on email and office, you'll see that you can get a domain based email for about five or six dollars per month. But in order to get the free option, click on advanced and then email accounts. And here you can create up to five email addresses for free. Simply click create to set up your first email. Enter a username and a password and be sure to make note of this password as you'll need it in future to log in. Then click create and that's how easy it is to set up your first business email. You will now have four free email accounts remaining. So repeat the process to create email addresses for your employees or other departments. Step three is to access your email. To log into your business inbox now and in the future, just go to bluehost.com forward slash webmail and log in with the details you created in the previous step. Instruct employees to log in here as well if you created accounts for them. And once you log in, choose any of the webmail applications to use. They're all the same and then you'll arrive inside your business inbox. Now there is one thing that I recommend you do to appear more professional, and that is to change the username which appears with your email. Now by default, your username will be the same as the email you created. And if you want to change your username, go to Settings, Preferences, and then Personal Information and then enter the name that you want to appear in your email under full name. You can enter your name plus the company name or perhaps just the name of your company if it's a support email, for example. Then send a test email to yourself to make sure that it's working properly. And now you can start receiving and sending emails from your business email account. That wraps up how to set up a free business email address in just five minutes. Click here if you'd like to get a recap of the three steps, subscribe to get more tutorials, share this video with friends, and comment below for what video I should do next. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.